I'm Matt Salakus, and I do the negative collection. I always went to flea markets in New York City. There were used to be a lot more in the early 2000s. Or in those days, I would go every weekend just to look at old photographs. So that got me interested in like looking at all the negatives too. And, oh, I could probably print some of these negatives. And I said, oh, I could probably sell these. So I started a, a website in, I think, 2008. And then I just started selling them and kind of took off. I like to look for things that are less common, like not pictures of somebody's cat or not pictures of somebody's family posing by the car. So if I see one negative out of the hundreds and hundreds that I'm like, oh, this photographer has an eye, I buy them all. And then I sort through them later. This whole box I bought here, I bought on the strength of one photo and I got burned because <laughs> the one photo was amazing and then everything else is junk, everything else is family photos. I spoke to a copyright attorney about it. He said, copyright belongs to the person who clicked the shutter or if that person signs it over to someone else. So I'm on like dodgy legal grounds with my thing, but I feel like I'm saving these from, you know, the world's great dustbin. Like these are gonna go in the garbage. The next step from the flea market is garbage. So if I don't buy these and preserve these, who's gonna ever see them? The guys at flea markets, they buy garages full of these things. So they don't really put any value on them. They're just like, I just need to get what I bought into someone else's hands for cash. When I saw Leonardo DiCaprio's face, I was like, I wonder if this guy knows who this is. So I like buried it in a bunch of like no name bullshit negatives. I was like, I need, I want all these. And the guy was like, okay, $10. Once again, I was like, okay, I think I got something good here. That's Frank Sinatra, isn't it? And that's Sammy. Holy shit. This looks like Sammy singing at somebody's wedding. Oh, Ricardo Montalban playing tennis. This is Rod Stewart at the pool. He's got his nails painted. These are um, printed on a paper called, it's like the finest quality ink paper they make. It's called platine. What a photographer would call double weight glossy paper. And this is Ali. This is, for, this is first round. Then I put it in a pile here, it'll be second round, and then a pile in there, third round, and then ultimately the lab will be the final. Like, no one stops and says hello. I mean, if you stop and said hello to every person, is all you'd be doing is saying hello to people. Uh, this guy's looking for cans. Honestly, the most rewarding thing is returning a negative to somebody because it's something I never thought they would ever see again, or, oh my God, my father's been dead 15 years, and I can't believe he found this picture of him, you know, in his prime. That's, that's a really good feeling. So I, I doubt this has been seen in 100 years. I mean, my man has a wagon of hay. As you saw, we were leaving and I was like, all right, let's go. And I said, let's just try one more. And we found this one. Mm -hmm.